Have you ever wondered what it's like to live out in the country on your own private six acre estate close to the shores of Lake Erie in a masterpiece of a home? Well, stick around in this video, you're going to find out. Represented by Justin Conico and Nathan Smith from Prime Real Estate, designed by Eric Friesian Design, this five bed, four bath home sits at over 4,500 square feet has one of the most phenomenal garages we have seen to date with epoxied floors and meticulously landscaped grounds. The kitchen, the millwork, and the fully finished basements are all wonderful spaces to explore. If you're bored by seeing the same old listing videos online, I am going to shake the dust off your keyboard today. We are at one of the most magnificent properties I have seen to date. The quality of construction is unlike anything I've seen in the area. The proximity, the location, the amenities, the beaches. You're literally just down the street from the number one milkshake in the world, according to Nathan Smith. <laughs> Nathan, why don't you tell our viewers where we're located today? Yeah, we're actually on the eastern tip of St. Thomas, home to 40,000 population, loads of development. We've got Amazon that just came in on the west side. Uh, commercial development, Starbucks coming in downtown, intensifying major. We've also got a $12 million sports complex that just came out on the south side and the biggest news yet is VW's coming with loads of jobs coming. So it's, it's amazing. The brand new EV plant, I mean, that was national news. And if you're looking to relocate to Ontario or you're looking for where to live in Southwestern Ontario, this is the channel and the video for you. A lot of people are looking at that 401 and 402 interchange amazing logistics and future growth are why people are looking in this area, mm -hmm. but there's so much more than just beautiful country properties. You are literally minutes from a world-class beach known as Port Stanley, but you're also close to two other ones, aren't you, Nathan? Port, Port Bruce and Port Burwell. Yeah, the lifestyle is unbelievable. You get quick access to all the amenities, cities like London and St. Thomas, mm -hmm. but as you can see standing outside of this masterpiece, you feel like you are on your own private estate. Let's talk about the actual construction of the home. The building materials combine both wood and stone in such a way where it feels very natural. Also, the construction quality of this home is second to none. Keep in mind, we see thousands of homes and we are looking at the details and how you do one thing is how you do everything. So why don't we show you how they did everything in this house? on inside guys now you'll notice your first steps in here is wide open open concept bright and airy you can actually see these Strasburger windows and doors throughout very high-end we've got an accented firewall with the TV up there and you get this little glimpse into the massive yard that you have and what I love most is you've got this flow from inside to out with these big windows. But uh, I think I've lost Justin. We gotta find him. Give me a minute. Well, it's very difficult not to get lost after seeing a pantry like this, seeing millwork done by Stone Mill like this, the built-in Fisher Pikeel fridge is truly something epic. You see the flat top KitchenAid induction oven. I literally cook with the same one. It is exceptional. Hard surface countertops, all of the hardware selections, the kitchen faucet, the sink, everything was done with thoughtfulness. This home feels warm. Natural materials like wood and stone with nice touches of colors and accent. You can really see the benefit of having a great designer involved in the process. The lighting accent in a kitchen, definitely one of my favorite features. I keep saying this over and over as we tour this home. And the built-in oven, plus the fact that the cabinets go right to the ceiling, absolutely wonderful if you're looking for a great storage solution. I also like how they integrated the kitchen and the seating area into the rest of the home. It doesn't 
doesn't feel chopped up, but it doesn't feel like a wide open space, truly something that needs to be seen to be appreciated. I need to show you something over here actually before we go to the rest of the house. So I know Nathan mentioned the covered area, the swim spot in the backyard. What I wanted to showcase to you is this laundry room. The way that they actually positioned it just off the kitchen makes for an efficiency of design. You could be cooking, dealing with this at the same time. Kids are coming out from playing. You could throw their clothes right in the laundry machine. It is absolutely wonderful. The outdoor cooking area, I'm definitely gonna have to show you, but let's head upstairs first. I need to show you a couple things there. Another thing I love about this house is the unity between the floors from bedrooms to kitchen to living room to stairs. It's all the same. All the natural light that this house has too, this almost floor to ceiling window behind me letting in ample, ample natural light is amazing. We're actually standing in, I like to call it a piano lounge. It could be a cigar lounge, anything you wanna make it. it. Could be a yoga studio or even an office. Up here, you've got two of the five bedrooms and they are very good size with their own walk-in closet. And actually one of them has a window that's perfectly set for eye level, which gives you the privacy but it also lets in the natural light without having to have blinds on it. But let's check out another wing of the house. I'm super jealous that you got to show them the upstairs, Nathan. Um, I'm gonna show them something that absolutely stopped me in my tracks. The powder room literally makes me feel like I'm at the Four Seasons, one of the coolest spaces I've ever seen. Again, kudos to the designer and the architects mm -hmm. and the builder. The intricacies are everywhere to be seen. Let me know in the comments if you appreciate this. And check out this primary suite. 270 square feet with a spa-like ensuite and an absolute endless walk-in closet. Tell me this isn't everything you ever wanted. You want somewhere for your kids to go play while you're having your friends over upstairs. This is the space for them. If you maybe have an in-law or somebody that's coming to live in and help you, this also suits those needs. The basement's fully finished, actually has an additional bedroom, a full gym and a full bathroom, plus ample storage. It's literally a 10 out of 10. So jump in the comments if you've been having fun so far. We have four more surprises for you. That door is just off the laundry room and surprise number one is this exterior kitchen. Southwest facing this way means that I get to watch the most beautiful sunset as I feed my family and my friends on my estate. So not only is this house a picture of perfection, all of these grounds, the tree line, everything is just pristine and adds so much to the lifestyle where you're not just buying a house, you're definitely buying a home. Nathan, what about that surprise number two? So we've got a 19 foot swim fit all in one jacuzzi. You can swim in it in the winter, in the summer, it's got a cool and a hot side, but what's our other secret that we have? Come on, our third secret is the secondary building. Let's head over there right now and then we'll end with number four. You're in luck that I don't have my bathing suit or I would be in that <laughs> swim spa right now. 
You have three garages, one operating as a shop currently, a secondary garage, and then this one's actually attached to the residence. So not only do you get a beautiful principal residence, the secondary suite is more than a secondary suite. It's like you're buying two houses. Nathan, why don't you take them on a tour and show them just how well laid out that square footage is. Let's do it, come on. So in symmetry with the main house to this one, we've got the same high-end finishes, vinyl plank flooring, hard surface countertops, and this is a complete separate dwelling like we said. It's a one bed, one full bath, it's got its own laundry, and it's even got an attached garage. And for my car collectors, hobbyists, and people that just like nice things, surprise number four is the garage of your dreams. PVC walls, epoxy flooring, heated flooring on top of that, it is literally paradise in there. Literally enough room for a lift, car collection, all the toys you can imagine. Like we said earlier, this has it all. If you're looking to move to the country, you definitely need to call us. We need to show you what it's like to live in these areas. People just like you are calling us off this channel every single day looking for the best areas and properties in Southwestern Ontario. So click that like, click that subscribe button, connect with us at the email, and we'll send you all the details and let you know the pros and cons of all the different areas and if this is the right home for you. We will see you on the next Prime Property Tour.